following program is sponsored by the Greek, Ely's Radio Shack dealer at 570 Altman in downtown Ely, and brought to you as a public service by Georgetown Media in Ely, Nevada. Ely Municipal Utilities Board Meeting, July 13, 2023. $67.76. I remind you just recently the city paid the reroute of private sewer line 
uh, on the phase three Murray Street project, which again is the owner's responsibility, as well as that 60,000 plus water line for that lattice uh, on equal protection. Mr. Chairman, at the previous meeting, September 8, 2022, I requested copies of the contracts for phase two and phase three of the Murray Street project that was posted in the meeting packet. I've yet to receive that. I don't either. Consent agenda. These items may be approved in one motion by the board. The first action of this is under for discussion and possible action. And approval of the consent agenda includes each of these items. Board members may remove any item from the consent agenda by notifying the board chair. So I have a motion to approve consent agenda item 3A1 of the June 8, 2023 minutes. I'll move. We have a motion. Okay. Make a motion and second. All in favor? Aye. 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 Motion carries. Public comment, reference, and minutes. Very good. We move on to old business. Robinson and Madam Line Company, RNMC, represent discussion only update to the utility board of the Robinson Nevada Development, Group Pit Development, and Water Mitigation Efforts within the city of Utah. I read the email this to me last night. Robinson continues to mine the Moose Pit Complex. There is a great note for water dewatering efforts from the South Block. About 8,597 gallons per minute is being pumped. 1,986 gallons per minute is going to Gleason Creek, and the rest is going to milk the ore processing. Our energy subsidy is delivering 1,162 dollars per minute into the city water system. Thank you. Public comment, reference to that? No public comment, we'll move on to new business. Board member, city clerk, please. Discussion for possible action recommendation for approval to remove, to remove past and utility penalties up to the amount of $3,770.75 from 5 Avenue B in Hill, Nevada, and request a property owner, Jose Arellano. Arellano. So, Mr. Arellano um, purchased this property at a tax sale, and he's got the principal due, and he's requesting a waiver of penalties. Okay. So, I'll make a motion to be approved. I'll yeah. second. Motion and seconds on the floor. All in favor? Aye. 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 Motion carries. Public comment. Moving on to item number two. Board member city clerk lead discussion of possible action recommendation for approval to remove tax and utility penalty up to the amount of $1,479.70 for 20 Sunshine Street Loop. The bat would request a property owner, Jose Alamino. Same situation. Mm -hmm. Same situation. Any concerns or discussion? No, I'll motion to do Motion to the floor. All second. Second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Motion carries. Public comment. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Mr. Chairman, uh, again, I'm not against these people getting the write off, but I want to give consideration and protection under the law. I want to remind you that I paid for my uh, property at 490 High Street, the principal and penalties. Instructed in a letter from Jennifer uh, Lee, City Clerk, dated November 25th, 2019. The city today has suspended the reimbursement for overpayments that I made to Grove Lee Grade School 622 High Street. You wrote off uh, all of the back billing for the Young Tom Bath when he bought the Plaza Hotel. He bought a tax sale just like I paid for the tax sale uh, for the old Grade School. You wrote all that off. I'm still waiting to be put on the agenda. It's been years. Um, I remind you again, the city gave the property owners of 790 Avenue I a $4,000 or more write-off, and they used all the utilities for years and had not paid. Federal law, again, prohibits the discrimination in any federally funded or assisted public utility. I'm again asking, second time, that you put me on the next agenda for consideration for approval to remove the past utility fees on um, for I want to clean it up. I pay every month. There should be zero there. Thank you, sir. Thank you, George. Very good. City department reports. <coughs> Board members. Yeah. Uh, 
Gary? Nothing. Great. Nothing? Nothing. Yeah. Nothing. I have nothing. Uh, public Works Director, Water Operator, Water Sewer Lehman, and Landfill Lehman. We have the reports. We have the concerns. Mike, you don't have anything? Okay. City Clerk? City Attorney? Nothing to report this time unless there's questions. Very good. <laughs> See treasure. Nothing. DJ is not here. He's not. He got the same memo I did. <laughs> okay. We got public comment. George, last public comment if you'd like. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Mr. Chairman, uh, I've asked. In the past, and again, we requested a complete list of properties and individuals that the city has permitted and allowed to park RVs on the city lots and city streets while living in them. I attend the uh, Regional Planning Commission meetings on a regular basis, and I've not seen one application for consideration. I am now a member of the Planning Commission, and I've yet to see anything to date. But as I travel around just going home, we have people setting up, Keith Carson, Put an RV on there. He's got a permit. I don't have a problem with that. Um, recently, uh, there was a uh, RV put on the trailer park at Orson Avenue. I don't have a problem with that. Where's the permit? I've been requesting a permit now for years. I was asking for a variance. I did that. Spent $340. Got nothing. Yet all around me, people are able to use their properties and they're setting up with no impunity. Not that I'm a member of the Planning Commission, if I don't get any information, I intend to address it with NRS 197-190, obstructing a public officer, interfering with a public officer. NRS 197-090 is the reference there. We got to resolve these things. I'm tired of coming up and I'm sure you're tired of seeing me come before you. Mr. Chairman, uh, I've got an ongoing concern in the uh, drainage problem that the uh, Bath family has caused me. Or I shouldn't say that. The drainage coming off the Bath property on the hill is coming down 7th Street and it's eroding my property. Uh, I've got 7 inch to 12 inch gouges in my uh, alleyway, roadway, which was asphalt at one time. Uh, needs to be addressed. I got a bid from Red Brothers, $24,500 to fix it. Your code says you may not drain onto a private property. Enforce the ordinance. That's all I'm asking. Had the city put in a uh, turbine gutter at uh, Beatty Street between the two properties, there would have been no problem. I've asked for years, but you uh, have ignored me. We need some kind of resolution. Mr. Chairman, at the uh, previous meeting, I've reported numerous RVs, possibly squatters, setting out throughout the city. Again, uh, these people, I want to know how many permits have you issued? How many of them are being built for uh, utilities? You need to know that. I want to know that. You're losing revenue. Someone's not doing their job, and they need to stop. So I have a good time, Mr. Chairman, but I want some information. Thank you, George. Well, we do love you and you're always welcome. What's that? We do love you and you're always welcome. Yeah, I'd like to. I'd love to get some information and I'd love to get moving on my properties. Uh, others are used to me. I'm getting zero. I've I got, got $550 you. a month for every property that I'm not able to rent. I'm just getting more than that. I'm a reasonable you, person. Cash is fine. Thank you. Thank you. I received a text from the city engineer Omer. He wanted to convey there's nothing to report and he's dealing with an issue in the field. Tell him thank you for I'll let him know. Let him know. We really appreciate your comments. Okay. okay. Anybody have anything else? If not, next meeting is 17. 17. Yes. Okay. <laughs> All right. With that, we stand adjourned. Thank you. You want another letter, John? Request. You want another letter for me requesting to be put on the agenda? Or can you remember that? Yeah, yes. You want a letter?
This has been a Georgetown production. This has been a Georgetown production, George Chatches reporting.